everyone and welcome back to my channel and today I will be unboxing my new Apple watch and I decided to get the Apple SE version the second generation and like I told you in my previous video I only order from the Apple website because I love that the love the fact that the products are very authentic uh, they come in the best quality ever i've had my experiences i'm getting my scissors to open up my box here it is i had my experience with ordering apple products off of generic websites and i even ordered um apple products off of amazon marketplace but unfortunately it always had an issue like you know because there are second party sellers on these online websites so it always had an issue after a while so i said you know what from now on i'm just gonna order everything from the apple website so enough talking from me right and all of my business so my apple watch came secure secured in this box so i'm gonna put it aside now here is the original packaging of the apple watch so let's open it up so i'm opening it from the sides and this box is like so cute and guess what before i even purchased this watch i made sure to do my research on the watch i've been comparing the se second generation to the newest version of the apple watch and also the apple watch version the series 8 um and i would say like many people would have said the series 8 is basically for those people who need all of the health features like the ekg app and heart monitor and all of those things but here it is my apple watch and i like i said i got the s E version here it says second generation i got the starlight gps version and i got 44 millimeters because i thought that the 41 millimeters was a bit too small for me <laughs> but okay and i also got a band so this band comes in the packaging here's the original packaging so it opens right up and it shows all the different band colors which is so cool i also bought some generic bands i bought some generic bands from shein and in all types of different colors and also the faces so let's get the apple watch box open first and apple has some instructionals of how to actually open the box but because i wear these long nails i really do not use them all the time i just use a scissors but it's not recommended to use the scissors because you might damage the product inside the box but so you can just pull it down like apple tells you um so i'm gonna get the other side uh, almost there okay so just pull it down and then the box will open up better so now we can open up the box i like to shake it out a bit because sometimes it's like really really stuck but almost there almost there almost there almost there almost there and we're there so this is the front of the watch um okay and then we have inside the box we have a few things as you can see first we have the apple watch the face um, and then we have some other things here, but before we go there, I'm going to show you this is the manual, the instructions on how to use the watch. And uh, this is all, of the, all that you need to know about the watch. So I'm going to put it on the side, we can read it later. And uh, let's get into what we want to get into, and it is the Apple Watch. So I'm going to check out the accessories first. This looks like the, okay, it's, it's the charger for the watch. So let's take that out. Just flip it open like this. Everything is like a little book, flip book. So this is the adapter for our Apple Watch. All right. So everything is like right here. Okay, cool. So we have the adapter for the watch. Gonna put it on the side, and then let's get to the actual watch. So. We're gonna take the face out and i really thought that the 44 millimeter 
would have been a little bigger than this so it's actually not what i really wanted so if this is the 44 millimeter then obviously the 41 is even smaller correct so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna go back on the website because i have a feeling that i'm gonna go and get the s e again no i'm not i think what i'm gonna do is i'm going to try out the series eight because i know the face of the watch is bigger but let's just keep this for now but but like i said it is it's an okay size for people who don't really want to be want their watch to be noticed for but for people who like to you know show off their watch you know they want it to be noticeable you can get the series eight and the series eight has about 46 millimeters to 48 millimeters i believe so let's get the band open and i know what you're thinking why did i get generic watch bands okay first of all a watch band on apple is like uh 99 dollars <sighs> who's gonna do that i literally bought this watch band off off Shein for about maybe two dollars and it actually it actually holds up the watch really good so what we're gonna do is open up the band box everything opens up just with a slide i'm um, gonna open up on both sides Um, let's open the box. Oh, so my box is a little jammed, guys. But let's, let's just give me a break. Give me a break. Uh, what's up? Okay, so I got it open. <laughs> so, I'm taking it out now. Ah, uh, ah. Uh another 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 instruction manual and it shows you how to attach the watch face to the watch band and it opens up like a flip book and i think that's so cool i really really like that that is what i really really like about apple it's just so cool okay. so that's my color watch band um, I also feel like there's something in here, but I can't really grab it out. I don't know why, but, um, maybe I'll check that later. But anyways, yeah, so it shows you how to attach the watch to the face. So it says to attach band, slide it until you hear it click. To put on and take off, pull the bottom of the band to stretch over the wrist. To remove the band, press button and slide out. So that is my Apple Watch. I just got it. And I'm really, 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 really excited. So you basically just take it like this and then just slide it in because there's an open opening right there. So you just basically slide it in till it clicks. Did you hear the click? I did. Okay. And then you take the other side and you just slide it in again. Just like that. Until you hear a click. Boom. Okay, so now I'm going to take off my old watch to show you how it fits. I got a size 7 because Apple usually recommends that you measure your wrist before you order it i did measure my wrist so let's see if it's gonna fit seems to be a little tight but i did measure it good thing i got that extra good thing i got that oh it fits it fits really good okay cool so that's my apple watch i'm gonna turn it on for you guys because i know you might be thinking like is she gonna turn it on so just give me a minute and I'm gonna turn it on. So I, we're gonna press the power button. He's turning on. Check it out. It's loading up. Let's see how long it's gonna take to load. It's still loading. 
Mm. It's still loading. So I did a review. I did watch a review about the startup time. I was told that it does take a little slower than the Series 8. I think that's why most people are going for the Series 8. But this is how it sets up, just like it would have set up with a iphone that shows you all the different languages you can get with set up so this is my apple watch series se and i got the second generation so i think i should have get maybe one inches up and get a eight inch band it's a little snug the seven inch but lucky me i bought some generic bands in different colors so that's my video and here's my watch